Today is the first day that you can file your taxes for last year. This article states that Canadians received an average of $2,053 in tax refunds. However, it also says that taxpayers who owed money owed an average amount of $6,890. Unfortunately, there are so many tax scams. There are a variety of scams and frauds happening in Canada with new ones invented daily. These scams have become very sophisticated and look very real and convincing. Scammers are sending text messages claiming to be from the CRA that may contain personal information. Do not reply to the text or click the link in the text message or provide them with your personal or financial information. It's a great idea to call Revenue Canada and check and verify that something is legitimate. There are also scammers that do identity fraud and they file false tax returns claiming to be you. A tax refund is as much as an asset as a diamond ring. And just as some thieves target jewelry stores, others specialize in stealing taxpayers' identities in order to create fake tax returns that provide large refunds. One way to try and prevent this is to file your taxes as soon as you can. If you file before a scammer files using your name and information, it's less likely that the scammer will be able to file under your name. Today is the first day that you can file your taxes in Canada. Last year, when I tried to file my taxes, I stayed up until 12.01 a.m. Needless to say, I stayed up only to learn that I couldn't file my taxes until 6 a.m. that day. It's very important to be honest. Always provide accurate, honest information when filing your taxes. It's a great idea to be organized with your tax information and returns. On the Government of Canada site, it states even if you do not have to attach certain supporting documents to your return or if you are filing your return electronically, keep your supporting documents for six years in case the CRA asks you to provide them later. Filing your taxes yourself has become a lot easier to do. I just recommend that you use a big, reliable, reputable company so that your information is more likely to be protected. If you can't file your own taxes, then make sure that you find a very trusted, reliable company to work with you. Even though an accountant may be doing your taxes, you need to check everything over for you are still responsible to make sure that the information is accurate. I just posted my newest video about how much you need to retire. If you don't want to watch that video, I'll just tell you the answer right now. Four million dollars. Thank you for all of your support. If you could please subscribe to my channel, I would truly appreciate it. I am now at 155 subscribers. Who wants to be the 156th subscriber? Save money, make good choices, and please be kind.